Good morning, my Scorpios. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Hope you guys are having a good birthday season. Happy birthday, Scorpio. Happy belated birthday to all who have had it. Happy birthday if it's today and happy future birthday if it's tomorrow and so on and so forth. Happy birthday. I hope it is a good birthday season. Happy Halloween, by the way, as well. I hope it was a good Halloween. Um, I have Ethereal Visions for the main deck, Black and Gold Tarot for the clarifying deck. The links to these decks can be found down below in the description box. Not my decks, just trying to make it easier for you guys to check them out. Some people like to get a closer inspection and look to see what the readers are using. Okay, Six of Pentacles reverse and a Three of Pentacles reverse. You know what that equals? a nine of pentacles reverse which means absolutely tapped out and drained could be drained in work drained energy finances drained and what do we do well we start doing something a little different and if you're not going to keep going down the road that's or dealing with the people that's doing that to you um six of pentacles reverse well we have the strength and the four of swords and some of you if this is a person you pull back and you're not you're really sticking to it. You're determined to move forward. Yeah, Hierophant reverse, Two of Pentacles to get your balance back. I feel like somebody was mind effing you all over the place. You want to be my, you you might be want to be F, but I mind F. You know what I mean? Three of Pentacles. Oh, you got two Capricorns going on here and a Seven of Wands. You know what this actually feels like? I think you were dealing with a very immature, I can't even speak, immature energy. Page of Swords reverse and a Nine of Wands reverse. Whatever they did, you were just done with it. Cap this feels like determination to not go back. Three of Pentacles reverse. Both Capricorn, but this devil, I feel like, is complete. Um, I, I it, it could be anger. It could it honestly could be anger, but I feel like you're determined only because we have a Seven of Wands here. This is you standing up for yourself, defending yourself, protecting your energy at this time, and not giving this person an iota of your attention. All right, let's see what's going on with our Scorpios. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Scorpio. If you are a Scorpio, know a Scorpio, feel like dealing with the Scorpio. Scorpios, I'm glad you're here. You could be a Scorpio and this resonates. You could be dealing with a Scorpio and it can resonate as the main story. And Scorpio could be the cross watcher. You watching this, you could be dealing with Scorpio or this could be about a Scorpio. Let's see what's going on. Let's see what's going on. Let's see what's going on. One more, one more, uh, one more, Scorpio, one more. Okay. All right. General energy for the Scorpios. What are the collective messages that need to come out? What are the collective messages that need to come out for the Scorpios? What's the general energy here? What's the, oh, there it is. The sun, happiness. So probably that's what our seven of wands is doing is protecting one's happiness because Empress reverse and the justice Libra and energy, both Libra and energy, actually, um, somebody could have made you feel not good enough to be in their company, or it could have been a job. Um, five of pentacles is just not, it's, it's a lack. It's a, it's a card of scarcity, a scarcity mindset. Empress reverse can feel it's just a need to nurture yourself. It's a need to focus on what you do have, who you do have, what you can be doing at this time. Not focusing on what you don't have. There's, there's enough in this life that can make us feel bad about ourselves. Then why, why add to it, right? So I feel like the justice um, is probably an ending of a cycle. I feel like you had to balance some scales. I feel like there was probably some tough, tough conversations that, that had to happen or need to happen. So you can get a balance in your life back here. But I do feel like somebody probably has it coming. I do feel that. So the, we have the sun here, which is great, Leo energy. What's influencing the sun? What's influencing the sun? Why are Scorpios in the sun? Are you on vacation, Scorpio? What's influencing the sun? The four of, yeah, you're, that's, I like this. Four of cups reverse, Cancerian energy. You're not at home sitting there thinking about, are they gonna call? Are they gonna give me my cup or their cup? Are they going to treat me good this time? Are they going to make an offer this time? You're not. You know what you're doing? You're back into life, four of cups reverse. 
you're not waiting for anyone. You're, you're, I feel like you are in the wands and here we are of the sun. I feel like you are taking control of your happiness. You're not sitting there waiting for somebody to come towards you to sit there and make you happy. You are making you happy. Eight of wands and the well, yeah, and the four of wands. Ooh, I like that. Some of you could be remodeling or doing something with your house or buying a house. Um, but the four of wands is about what you deem, where you find your security, like where, uh, yeah, the four of wands is where we fear, feel at the most at home. And you have the well, which to me, there's, a, there's two extra major arcana in this deck. And the well is about being in deep in one's emotions. It's about healing waters. I feel like you were dealing with somebody that was tapping your well dry because they would come take a bucket of water and leave. Come take a bucket of water and leave. And what you're new, I can't even freaking speak. I'm getting so mad at myself. What you're doing now is replenishing those waters. And I feel like this is rest, rejuvenation, um, just feeling good. You could have the just the right people around you. And I do feel vacation with you guys, eight of wands. And travel, definitely travel, movement. Putting yourself back out there. Not letting somebody make you feel bad about you anymore. I just feel like you're putting that person in the back, in the rear view mirror. As you drive off on your chariot. What is the reason for the reading, Scorpio? What is the reason for the reading? What is the reason for the reading for the Scorpios? Reason for the reading. What is the reason for the reading? The Knight of Cups reverse. Somebody who doesn't know what they want, so they come in. What did I say though? I said with that well, you're refilling those waters. It's like rest and rejuvenation because this Knight of Cups reverse came in, had an empty cup and when they left, you know, it's like really upright, his cup's empty. You fill his cup, he's out of here. You, it's an unreliable energy. It's somebody who probably has other people they're dealing with. It's someone you can't rely on. And that is why Scorpios, I think you're really defending yourself, really sticking up for yourself. Whatever they did was the last time you, they were able to do it. I can tell you that, three of swords. This is you defending your yourself, protecting your energy and moving on and not looking back. I think somebody really pushed you too far this time. What's in the past, Scorpio? What's in the past? What's in the past? The devil, Capricorn once again, strong connection, somebody who won't grow up. Maybe somebody actually had um, addiction issues, but it's a, it's, it's, it's a hard energy. It's a hard thing to pull yourself away from. That's why, I mean, look at this devil card. It's, I think it's the prettiest card in this entire tarot deck. It's reflective. It, you can see yourself in, in, in the devil. You can see yourself in this person's life. They do, they know what they're doing. Whoever this is, they know what they're doing. They, they give you just enough so you can see yourself because they get you hooked, but they don't really give you what you really need. They just want you there so they can take what they need and they kind of discard you, ghost you, whatever it is. And I just feel like this was a hard energy to break yourself free from. Page of Pentacles and the Ace of Cups. And I feel like you gave them everything and they still were like, well, I don't know. I really don't know. Yeah, they do know, but they also know what they're doing. They're wasting your time. Seven of Pentacles reverse, four of wands reverse, eight of wands reverse, knight of wands, king of wands. Is that a knight or king? Oh, six of wands reverse. And then here's our Gemini, the lovers on a ten of swords. More Gemini. It's like you lost yourself in this energy. You created this love and, and somehow they became the center of it. And you're not doing that anymore. What is on Scorpio's mind? 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 The queen, yeah, queen of cups, Cancerian energy. You want your cup full. You want to be whole again. Um, in, in, the, in the eyes of the law, at least in, I would pretty much say in most countries in the way the law works, but definitely in North America here in the United States, when you go to court, it's about being whole again, right? And I feel like in morally, this person made you, 
they took so many pieces out of you that you just want to be whole again and i feel like there's some karmic justice coming to make you whole again that's just it's that's just how i'm really getting this with the queen of cups your cup is full here you are the king of cups um, but I feel like this, the Queen of Cups is your feminine aspect. It's the, the Cancerian part of you. Um, so you can feel confident to put yourself out there because I feel like somebody could have rejected you and that hurt your masculine side, your King of Cups side. And so this is about healing the feminine side. It's about realizing that you really weren't the problem, Scorpio. They were the problem. They had commitment issues. There was a reason why they, they can't build a four of wands. They don't know how. They don't, they don't know what they're doing. And so you are in a position to sit there and try to raise them. That's what their parents are for. So you have to fill your own cup. And that's that. probably the first step is go take a vacation. Go away. Do something fun. Let this person grow up. And better yet, just leave this person behind probably. Because I think this has been a very toxic cycle. Who I'm reading for. What's the near future? What's the near future for the Scorpios? What's the near future for the Scorpios? What's the near future for the Scorpios? Near future. And the, yeah, Page of Swords Reverse. Page of Swords Reverse is the bad, it can be a bad news card. So I, you could be done with somebody, they, they're gonna try to beep right back into your life. But the first feeling I got with this Page of Swords Reverse and it's an air sign is don't open the door to conflict. I do feel like they're probably going to try to reach back out with an apology. Seven of swords reverse going on over here. They don't know. They didn't know. Nine of pentacles reverse. Ten of swords. They do know. Just know that they did know. High priestess reverse. There's red flags all over it. I would stay back on your four swords. Stay back in recuperation time in um, healing, replenishing your cup. Because just as your cup gets full... Here they come. I feel like this is actually a red flag saying, hey, they're going to reach back out. But this is also the first feeling I got when I saw this card is don't go looking for borrowing trouble from the devil again. Don't, like, don't go knocking on the devil's door. Don't look on their social media. Don't look in their messages. Don't even care what they're doing. Try to detox yourself from this energy because I do feel like you could have been very, some of you could have really been addicted to their energy. And not so much, not for the lows, but to the highs when they do come back and when it's really good. So the page of swords reverses, I feel like it's turning off like you're, in the old ways you'd say your television set but turning off their energy so you don't have to see what they're doing stay in your bubble for for now until it gets easier and it's some of you yeah take a vacation if you can if you can not everybody can i, I understand that but if you can it would be a good time to get away you got the sun and the four cups reverse the sun and the four cups reverse here for Scorpios. What is this about? The sun and the four cups reverse. Leo and Cancer. The sun and the four cups reverse. And the three, yeah, healing time. The best way to heal is not sit in it, not be home, not think about it, not wondering what they're doing, not seeing what they're doing. It's about wands, it's about action, it's about getting out there, it's about m mixing up the energies distracting yourself what's the th why the three of swords reverse libra and energy why the three of swords reverse it's funny we got cancer we got leo i've seen the virgos but then we have libra we have you okay why the three of swords reverse and the three of pentacles yeah and so three of pentacles is about being around people who build you up not tear you down Three of Pentacles are about the, the the trunks of the tree here. This is where you you get your life, where you where you're gonna get your um, nutrients from, and it's from the good energies in life. These are the people you want to be around, and I really feel like this is this is where it's at. Some of you you're throwing yourself into work, and that's not a bad thing either. Three of Pentacles because you keep doing that, and you're gonna be flipping this Nine of Pentacles reverse into a Nine of Pentacles upright. This is independent wealth going on over here. Um, but yeah, I just feel like this is busy work, honestly. And it's, it's a good, I, I feel like it's a good thing. You have the sun, you have the three of pentacles. It feels like a good distraction. What is the knight of cups reverse Pisces energy reason for the reading? What is the knight of cups reverse reason for the reading? 
the devil reverse. Look at that. Reason for the reading is to unattach yourself from the devil. They didn't have it to give. And I mean love. I honestly feel like somebody's got, instead of the heart chakra, it's just like this iron vault. It's, 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 it's just with all these locks on it. They're very protective of someone coming in and throwing the, like it, it, it's it's like they're afraid of vulnerability or they're it's they're very protective of their energy of their heart but the problem is is they were creating a three of swords by being unavailable to you they were what they don't want done to them they were doing to you and there, there it lies in the problem what is the devil in the past capricorn energy what is the devil in the past and the hermit and you trying to understand, trying to heal them, trying to understand how to heal them. The hermit is going and, and analyzing and he holds a lantern. He holds the star because you really put your energy because you really thought this was the one. They just have a little issues, you know, give them love, love it out of them. Show them a better way. It just wasn't enough. What is the queen of cups on your mind? You got the five of swords reverse. I feel like finding peace after this pulling yourself so far back this person would have to reintroduce themselves when they meet you again because you won't even know who they are what's the five of swords reverse and the queen of cups on your mind and the eight of cups reverse i feel like you're the cups like i said with this knight of cups reverse i maybe you've had eight cycles with this person or eight years or eight months whatever this is eight of cups reverses is, is every time they came it's like they took a cup but then who were they they taking this cup to the knight of cups they were bringing it back to you. It was like you were a, a place of source for them. Yep, another one, Ace of Cups reverse. And to the point where you didn't have it to give. Hierophant reverse, having to let this one go. And the tower, there you are. And this is you not backing down. Two of Pentacles, because this is about your balance. This is long-term thinking, happiness, security. And this person's throwing you off on all of them. What is the Page of Swords reverse in the near future? This is Page of Swords reverse can be obnoxious anywhere because, you know, tarot is a spectrum. So over here, we can have somebody who can be a bit of a narcissist in the making, honestly. When they don't get their, their way, it's very bratty. It's very, you know, abusive. It could be verbally abusive. Um, they, they feel like they're the ones slighted. And if it's over here, it's just, oh, well, I didn't know sleeping with 10 other people were going to hurt you. I didn't know. You know, it's both of them are, are, it's very hurtful to deal with. Page of Swords reverse in the near future. Page of Swords reverse in the near future for the Scorpios. What is that about? Page of Swords reverse in the near future. And the Queen of Swords. Oh, look who's out to play. The Queen of Swords. And I feel like this is you, Scorpio. This They're going to try their same bullshittery and you're going to be like, no, 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 no. I'll, I'll finish your sentence. The end. And that's it. I think you're done with them. Hangman, pulling yourself back. Three of Wands, seeing what else is out there because Scorpio isn't going back. All right, my dears, have a fantastic rest of your week. Um, I Get away if you can. If some of you have safe travels if you're traveling. All right, Scorpios, I will see you guys when I see you. Have a great week. Take care.